What does it mean to you as a grade three, uh, a kid in grade three, to be able to do something like this? It makes me feel great. It's a small but mighty gift. These kindergarten and grade three students at Park Meadows Elementary have spent the last week putting together Valentine's Day cards for the residents at Legacy Lodge, with the hope that their small act of kindness will make someone feel less lonely this year. Did you make a card for a senior? Yeah? How did it make you feel to be able to do something like that? Good. Are you happy to be able to make cards for some seniors? Yeah. The idea to create the cards first came after Steph by Notsi Scrogi saw a similar thing being done online. I messaged Ms. Vandermeer and Ms. Higgin and thought it would be a cool idea to help out the seniors and put a smile on their faces, especially during the pandemic and all the sadness going around and they can't have many people in with them. And Kids were excited to do it, so we thought we'd tell their teachers and go ahead and do it. Jen Higgin, a kindergarten teacher at Park Meadows, says she wanted to teach her students an important message while doing this project. We were just telling them, like, you know, our houses are, and school rooms are filled with, like, laughter and joy and fun all day long, but sometimes when you're older, you might be a little more secluded or alone. So we're just trying to, you know, spread that, make everyone happy. Bridge City News received a statement from Legacy Lodge that reads, Legacy Lodge residents are so grateful that the younger generation has been considerate enough to think of all of us. It is very heartwarming and brings a smile to each and every one of our residents to receive these types of cards. It lets them know that someone out there is thinking of them, especially during these tough times when they might not be able to see their grandkids. For Bridge City News, I'm Angela Stewart.